How's it going, everybody? I'm Nikki Delventhal, and this is my dog, Camper Delventhal. We live in a 2006 Toyota Prius, and we're here to take you along on the wild ride. So fasten up your seatbelts and let's have some fun. Don't forget, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share with your friends, and turn on notifications. Camper and I would be so thankful. On last week's episode, Camper and I take you to the world's largest trucker party at the world's largest truck stop. It was an absolute blast. Then, after a good night's rest in Hotel Prius, we take you on a tour of the place. You will not believe your eyes. You could spend all week here and never leave. But we had more adventures and a huge surprise for you guys, so we packed up and started the log drive into South Dakota. Good morning, good boy. What's going on out here? You wanna go outside? <laughs> this one's heavy. Well, thank you, camper, for getting the doors for us. It is already getting hot out. You guys, last night was hilarious. This car was shaking so vigorously. The wind gusts are so high, it keeps waking us up. The car is shaking. And that freaking sound on the flagpole. Whew. Tonight, hopefully, we'll get a better night's sleep. All right, we gotta keep going west. Let's go. On this route, while you're driving, you pass what feels like thousands of wall drug signs over the span of a few hundred miles. Oh, uh, mom, we gotta stop. We've made it. Waldrug. Waldrug opened in 1931. It was purchased by a guy named Ted Husted in this what he called middle of nowhere town of only 231 people. While South Dakota originally served a purpose as a stopover for train travelers and visitors passing through. And their small pharmaceutical business was not doing so well at first until his wife Dorothy had the grand idea to offer free ice water to any thirsty travelers on their way through. And it worked. So well that it became the place it is today. With tons of shops, coffee, a cafe that sits over 500 people. They have over 300 oil paintings and so much more. I used to live in Texas for two years, so you guys know I love a good cowboy hat and cowboy boots. How cute is this one? Camper, do you want to try on the hat that we're going to get? 
All right, here we go. What else we got in here, camper? Destiny is not a matter of chance. It is a matter of choice. Create your destiny wisely, my friend. Zoltar says your future life will be very sunny. I see it in a chest full of money. Be free to spend it as you see fit. Well, we did. We got this new cowboy hat. Thanks, Zoltar. See you next time. All right, to the back. I highly recommend stopping here. This place is so weird and cool. All right, mister, back in the Prius. We gotta be somewhere. All right, back on the road. But first, we're gonna need a bigger cup of coffee. Cheers. Good. All right, eight miles away from Wall, South Dakota is the entrance to Badlands National Park. So we are gonna take the scenic route to where we're going today. Thank you. Thank you. See you next time. Bye. One of my favorite things is watching baby cows running. <laughs> Amber likes watching them. No. Camper, I have a huge surprise for you. There's the surprise! Surprise number two! <laughs> Look who it is! Oh, he's like, he's checking out his new home. There's your new home. <laughs> Yee. I love you. Here's the surprise. We're moving on up in the world. And we've got mom with us. This is crazy. Four wheel campers heard we were looking for a new home and told us we could borrow this for a few months. Okay, hand over the keys, lady. <laughs> He is 
ready. Wow! Amber, do you love it? Oh my God, I love this thing. One of my biggest concerns when picking out a rig is how to keep campers safe. And that's why I loved the Prius so much and why I've been in there for so long is that it has built-in climate control. So if an unexpected heat wave came through or I had to run into a store for 15 minutes, I knew that the car would stay at a steady temperature and camper would be just fine. So moving into this pop-up camper, I had to find a solution for that. So I did a ton of research and I ended up reaching out to EcoFlow and asked them if I could try out their EcoFlow Wave, their portable air conditioning unit. I chose this unit because it's the most powerful of its size, ideal for what we're doing. And I tested it hooked to shore power for unlimited AC and on its own completely off grid. The small add-on battery allows for three hours of cooling without needing to be plugged in, but with a portable power station, you can get 12 hours or more depending on the unit. Ways to recharge the add-on battery are also versatile. But my biggest selling point was the easy maintenance as this unit redirects any water that you would normally find with these units to its heating tube, allowing the water to evaporate, keeping your area dry. After a few weeks of use, even through a heat wave, I can confidently say I love this thing. So much so that I have decided to partner with them. So if you yourself are interested in any of the EcoFlow products, please use the link in my description as it really helps out Camper and I. All right, right now I am taking everything from my Prius and slowly moving it into the pop-up camper. It has been a few hours and I'm like only halfway done. Oh my goodness. Yeah. You excited to sleep in here tonight, Camp? <laughs> we're waterproofing this because last time we were here, he peed the bed <laughs> in this exact spot. He was on steroids though, wasn't he? <laughs> oh, stop, 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 no! In case you missed, let's play that again. I'm so mad at you, but I understand. I know you're on medication. Waterproof, she is on. Okay, I was not meant to make beds, I was meant to make videos. <laughs> I think it's time to go jump in the lake. He says no, <laughs> get out of the water. <laughs> Eventually Camper will be a water boy, but today's not that day. He got really far in though, didn't he? Right next to the beach is the shower house. So next up is shower time. I forgot soap. Oh well. That felt so good. Home sweet homes. It's dinner time. Ah, suddenly I feel healthy. All right. Huh. Looks like it's a bag salad night, Mom. I can't eat out of a bag. Go for it. You guys already know what this is. You take all your ingredients, you pop them in, you shake it up, and voila, bag salad. Dinner is served.
Are we getting ready for bed, camper? Getting there. <laughs> Night, Mom. Good night. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, and turn on notifications. And if you'd like all of our videos early access and during that time completely ad free, join our Patreon for as low as $1 a month. Have a great day. We love you all. Go ahead. Done. I think I have whoa, whoa, whoa. Right oh, no, 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 Oh, seriously? Oh, well, okay. I know, I know. Here he is. <laughs> Are you... <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah.